Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got LA Colors Pink Diamond, and I'm going to stamp it. I've started off with Peel Ease as my base coat, and here is LA Colors Pink Diamond. And I topped it off with some quick dry top coat from Pro FX. I'll be stamping with my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper using my Beauty Big Bang Scraper and BC08 Stamping Plate and my little Spark Mat. So let's get started. Today I'm stamping with black from Born Pretty. Just a black stamping polish. Here we go. Let's get to it. So that came out pretty good. Pretty happy with it. Cleaning that plate off with some acetone real quick and do it again. Now I'm going to put this image on all of my fingers except my ring finger. I've got another image picked out for it. And I'm working on that accent nail thing. Oh, and I am cleaning off my stamper on a lint roller. <laughs> I think I always forget to say that, but if you've watched, you know. Here we go. Kerplunk. And this is turning out pretty good. I knew I wanted to try to use some of these metallics from the LA Colors uh, collection that I had gotten not too long ago. I wanted to go ahead and wear some of them real quick. Off to the pinky we go. And I'm going to turn this plate around and I'm going to use this little image right next to the corner. And I'm going to try to put that up next to my cuticle line. And there's some extra stuff on it. So I'm going to try to get some of that extra off of there. Which is giving that polish just too much time to dry. And here we go. We've got an Ipsy coming. It didn't take all the image. So I'm going to clean that off and put on some Pro FX Sticky Base Coat and redo that rascal. There we go. Let's hope that this time it works. Get some excess off of there and line that thing up. And there we go. Good job. So I'm going to clean up some of this excess stamping polish off my fingers with some tape. Get as much of that up as I can. Tap, tap, tap. There we go. I'm going to use this Lillian Garden um, Acetone Additive. I put two drops in my dampen dish and then I put some acetone in there. It helps keep your fingers from looking all white and chalky and dried out. And I do this all the time. I just never show it and I thought for once I would, you know, get around to showing it. My friend Connie turned me on to that stuff, and um, I love it. It's addicting. An additive that's addictive. There we go. I've loved everything I've tried from Lily Ann's Garden. So I am going in with my cleanup brush and just doing some tidying up here. You know, of course, that black's kind of smearing around all over my fingers, and it's making quite a mess. Um, Maybe not so, it's not showing up as much on camera as it did in real life, which may be a good thing. It's pretty yucky. So I'm going to top it off with some of this Bundle Monster Smudge Free Top Coat and kind of seal that stamping in. But that stuff's just so shiny, them lights are just wearing it out. I turn one of them down. There we go. I love this stuff. I mean, see, I'm just going over it and over it and no smearing. Love it, love it. If I can just remember to use it all the time, we'd be good. Now I'm going to top it with some posh top coat to seal it all the way in. You know, this girl's hooked on her glossy top coat. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful. I love it. I really did like this one. I hope you enjoyed you enjoyed it and you liked it. I'd love to hear what you think. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you got any of these polishes. So there it is. Here comes my swatch photo. 
And that is it for today. I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.